Title, Texas Power Grid Does a Gymnast Flip, Breaks Records Amidst Heat Wave Showdown. TL, DR, It's Hotter Than a Hot Pocket Fresh Out of the Microwave in Texas. With temperatures climbing to a scorching 100 degrees Fahrenheit in Houston, seriously, what? Power usage in Texas hit an all-time high as everyone and their grandma cranked up the AC to survive. The Texas Power Grid, managed by Urquhart, flexed its muscles and managed to handle the power load. This time, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, Texans everywhere are cranking up their ACs like a DJ at a club. It's hotter than a jalapeno in a sauna out there, with the mercury hitting a fiery 100 degrees Fahrenheit in Houston. This is almost as high as my grandma's best bowling score, and let's be real, that's pretty impressive. This extreme heat has led to an all-time record in power usage, as Texans attempt to chill out in their own personal igloos. Urquhart, the state's power grid operator, reported that power usage peaked at a preliminary 80,828 megawatts at 6 p.m. CSD. That's like running 1 billion LED light bulbs at once. Imagine the disco you could have with that. But don't go planning a dance-off just yet, because the record was previously set at 80,148 megawatts last year. So what's next? Is Erka planning a repeat performance tomorrow? Well, buckle up folks because they're predicting peak demand to hit another record at 83,040 megawatts on Wednesday. Now, Erka is claiming they've got the power, situation under control. But let's take a trip down memory lane, shall we? Back in February 2021, a freeze left millions of Texans in the cold, quite literally, without power, water, or heat. Let's just say Urquhart was sweating bullets, scrambling to prevent a grid collapse. On a lighter note, here's a toast to all you Texans out there who listened to Urquhart's call to conserve energy earlier in June. You've not only been helping to keep the lights on, but you've also kept the AC running during this heatwave showdown. Cheers to you. Looking ahead, some smarty pants at the US Power Demand Office, is that a thing? Think demand will cool down in 2023 after peaking in 2022. Yet, with the economy and population in some belt states like Texas growing faster than my cousin's tomato plants, electric use is expected to continue skyrocketing. So here we are, Texans. Sweating it out in the midst of a heat wave and watching Urquhart juggle power demand like a seasoned circus performer. Will they continue to deliver, or will we see a repeat of the 2021 freeze debacle? Only time will tell. And for the rest of you, how would you handle a scorching 100 degrees Fahrenheit? Would you turn your home into a personal igloo, or would you tough it out to conserve energy? What's the wildest thing you've done to stay cool during a heat wave? Let's get the discussion flowing, folks. Disclaimer, this article is for informational purposes only. It is not intended to provide advice on health, energy management, 